tens of thousand dollars into the process, which is why we try and keep to make sure that you know, the building department and the, the clerk's office and everybody is always on top of the escrow of the invoices and get a bigger escrow with the larger things coming in. But isn't that where the Taxpayer Protection Act comes into play? We can send Rich out with a big hammer. You owe us money. <laughs> if we're in the 12th month and it's on the agenda, the application, and there's money in escrow, and the applicant doesn't show what we've done all this work in the 12th month, do they take any money out of the escrow for the work that not be done or anybody else done? Yeah, if yeah. there's they money in escrow, it should be paid out to any open invoice. Okay. They submit bills monthly and they take it out of the escrow accounts. Okay. I wasn't sure. Okay. Yeah, so every month they submit a bill, what they worked on, and then it comes out of the escrow account. Good. And if for some reason you get somebody and say you sent out letters today, but you know your next two meeting agendas are full, and they submit something to try and get on the second one, it's going to be in the discretion of the chairman and say, okay, well, look, I'm not going to squeeze them on this agenda because it's such and such, but he's not going to just take them out after they've made the submission. Okay. It would be in the chairman's Denied. Denied. Any other comments on that? <laughs> no. Anybody else want to stay? Let's get out of here. Can I, have, can I have a motion to authorize council to draft two reports to the board of trustees? Can motion. Second. Second. <laughs> Third, fourth, fifth. Six. Wait, hold on. All in favor? All in favor? Aye. Aye. Motion to close. Pick two. <laughs> aye. Aye. We all vote aye. God, I need to measure back. <laughs>